Well, during the pandemic, Latter-day Saint church leaders asked the foyers of every church meeting house throughout the world to have art of Jesus Christ. Arts and religion specialist Kara Makita gives us a look at her upcoming general conference special titled Sacred Images. In May of 2020, the First Presidency of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints asked facilities managers to place artwork of Jesus Christ in the main entrances of the faith's buildings throughout the world. They want Latter-day Saints and visitors to see that sacred image. Members of the church, when they come in to recognize they're coming into his church, into his building to worship him. The church's printing division is where the artwork for meeting houses and temples is created. Images are printed, mounted, framed, and shipped, all done with the greatest care. Our associates take great care and pride in that they're putting something together that's going to touch somebody's life. As the church expands its art collection, there is a growing number of Latter-day Saint artists who are creating works that reflect the various cultures and races of the faith. Kwani Povey Winder has helped create a sisterhood of these young Latter-day Saint artists who are bringing diversity to these images. Already there's more of us and there's always more that are kind of joining this call to create spiritual art. Over the decades, church leaders have commissioned works that reflect the ministry of the Savior. Latter-day Saints and visitors from around the world can see these pieces in both the Conference Center and the Church Museum of History and Art. We toured both with director Laura Polson Howe. He Comes Again to Rule and Reign by Mary Sauer is a newly commissioned work. Art is a visual language, and so the better we can get at conversing in multiple visual languages, the better we can be at helping people know and understand and recognize themselves as part of the family of Jesus Christ. Camille Johnson, the new primary general president, showed us the art she chose for her office. This is Michael Malms, and a little child shall lead them. I love that this daughter, this child, is pointing her family towards the Savior. And in fact, as you look to the right, there's it looks like perhaps a friend coming and taking direction from this young girl. Religious art, images of deity, or scenes from the scriptures inspires people of all faiths. It is often an emotional connection to their worship. Join us as we explore the importance of sacred images. Carol Makita, KSL 5 News. Thanks, Carol. Well, Sacred Images will air Sunday, October 3rd at 12 noon, following the morning sessions of General Conference. And it's just one of several documentaries you can watch before, in, between, and after conference. Plenty to choose from there next weekend.